Well, there were gadgets and gizmos aplenty in Austin today as hundreds gathered at the Palmer Event Center for the Maker Fair. Fox 7's, Fox 7's Ray and Christensen joining us for that. The inventions and creativity here are absolutely amazing. This is Annabelle. She is an interactive robot, and I'm going to let her take over. More than 200 makers are here with their gadgets and creations they have made. Take a look. From pyrotechnics with flamethrowers to super cool robots, crafters, educators, tinkerers, hobbyists, and artists gathered at the Palmer Event Center this weekend for the sixth annual Maker Fair. A maker is somebody who, if you made it with your hands and you put it together, then you would be a maker. More than 200 makers entertained curiosity seekers of all kinds. From quilts to steampunk R2-D2 robots, from handmade drones all the way to an entire wearable tech fashion show. I uh, worked on the balloon bodice and we used a weaving pattern called a basket weave. So Stacy Pineapple I, and Nate the Great spent more than 14 hours tying, weaving, and blowing up their project. Our ideas that were inspired by the Van Gogh's Starry Night painting, and we tried to create that in balloon form. Their custom balloon dress. It's really fun. I mean, the kids love it. Made out of hundreds of balloons that's unpoppable. I've been nervous about mostly table edges and pins. <laughs> was a hit at the show. I love balloons. Basically, um, you take balloons, you make something completely that's ephemeral just for a little while, and it makes people so happy. I, I, I like, they're just like, ah! And the inventions and creativity didn't stop there. Whether it's fashion, or the need for speed, there was something for everyone at this greatest show and tell fair on earth. Makers Fairs happen all over the world. Here in Austin, it takes place every May. One more time, Annabelle. Reporting from the Palmer Events Center, this is Annabelle for Fox 7 News.